from what you've experienced serving as a bishop yeah. yourself, what would you tell the members out there? Um, go easy on it. <laughs> um, I might be walking out of um, just hearing about somebody's death mm -hmm. um, and struggling with that emotion and, and maybe panicking a little bit about, oh, oh my, I guess I do funerals, um, <laughs> and having never done one before. Um, and then somebody comes up with something totally, you know, different about the activity this week, um, budget, or is it, oh, should we get ice cream? And it's hard to be totally present for both of those things yeah. and to compartmentalize. And, and I, I, I feel sometimes one of the things that I'm guilty of looking at my own um, service is, is not recognizing and helping people feel that they're important in those situations. I, I can be distracted a little bit and um, with something else that's going on and struggle with that. And I, I guess every, every bishop, everybody in every calling is doing something that they're not totally comfortable with. And that's how we grow. That's mm -hmm. how we learn. And everybody should be blessed with a calling that they feel totally inadequate for. <laughs> um, because you learn a lot about yourself. You see you see your weaknesses, but you also get a glimpse of the godliness, if I might say that, that is in you. Your combination of talents and abilities and personality, and once in a while you see the, the impact or effect on somebody who needs help, and, and it's rewarding to recognize that uh, I didn't totally mess that up. Hopefully even maybe I little, helped a little bit.